And that message is that you can be charged even if you just show up to these illegal events. Now, behind me is where that whole night started, and the deputies then gave chase. Face down on the ground, right now. On the on face, dude. These moments show the arrest of two accused street racing event attendees after Pierce County deputies broke up a large illegal event at a warehouse in Fredrickson. When the def first deputy rolls into the parking lot, he turns his lights on and everybody just starts running from them. Sergeant Darren Moss took us through the night as about 30 cars took off from the deputies. At one point, he says while one deputy was chasing a car, another vehicle, this red Mustang, starts chasing the officer. The backup patrol unit then gives chase and does a pit maneuver. Uh, Face down on the ground, like I told you. Arms out to the side like an airplane. It's very unusual, not common to see someone chasing a patrol car, especially when they have their lights and siren on. It's dangerous. Moss said those in another vehicle were also arrested after being followed by an airplane belonging to the Washington State Patrol. Times have changed in Washington State. Not only can you now be charged if you attend one of these illegal car shows, restrictions on when police can pursue have been drastically loosened. Without these new law changes, our deputies would not have been able to pursue any of those vehicles. For the people that say, oh, it's not a big deal, I want you to think back to August 14th when somebody was just trying to have fun and he was revving his engine on 176 in Canyon. He blew a light at 160th. No one was racing him. He collided with another driver. Both vehicles burst into flame and now we have two dead people. Driver, get out. Go face down on the ground. It's not safe. It's not going to fly anymore. Right now. So four people were arrested in total ages 15 to 20. They're all facing street racing attendee charges, and the drivers were also charged with eluding. Reporting in Pierce County, Paul Rivera, Como News.